Hi, everybody. Welcome to the show. <sighs> I've been gone for a minute. Anyway, Thanksgiving is over. And now it's Christmas time. Holy smokes, this year is going by fast. Anyway, I thought I'd put a little Spanish Christmas music on until it's time to, I guess, bring out the the other soul stuff, you know. Because I'm so, you know, multicultural and everything. Anyway. Um... You know, we'd be dancing on that. Anyway, um, so I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. Um, I love my impromptu friends who like to call and say, Hey, we're going to be leaving for Paris in three days. Can you be ready to go? <laughs> no. Um, but, um, I did spend Christ Thanksgiving, um, you know, pretty much by myself, you know, cooking, as I told you all before. But what we did do, which I thought was really great, I was really against it. I'm going to be honest. In the beginning, I just really didn't want to go. But you know what? Life is short and you only live once. And even if you live twice, you won't remember unless you have some of those deja vu things. But anyway. So um, I thought it was really interesting. We went to uh, Ungonquin, Maine, and uh, it's a resort area, but it was fabulous. You know, somebody asked me about pushing my glasses up. Yeah, I probably need to get them adjusted, but also my eyelashes are too long. So when I push them up too far, they scrape up against the, the glasses. So anyway, this is where we went, um, and I'll show it to you. It's really nice okay uh if you get a chance they're already booking it's a really a summer resort um at the beachmere inn is where we stayed in ungonquin maine uh first i was like maine who wants to go to maine it's cold enough in new york going to new england all the way up there but uh and i'm very very happy that i i did go and um it was a lot of fun it's always nice to travel with people uh, that you love and that you really get along with. It was a lot of fun. But I just wanted to show you some of the pictures, how gorgeous it is, if you can see this. Very nice, the rooms, um, right on the ocean, the beach, the water, all of it. Very, very, very nice, you know. And I think, um, and it's this place where we were, it was called the, the Beach Mirror. But they have lots of places. It's really gorgeous. It really is. Um... Uh, the room was very nice. Um, you know, it's the um, Beachmere Inn on the ocean. So, was it cold? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was cold. It was cold, but it wasn't that bad. It wasn't like it was, you know, like 20 degrees colder than New York. So, we had a wonderful trip. It only took five hours to get there. And it was very, very nice. So, anyway, I just wanted to say, if you have some time, it started booking up already. Um, but it was good. The food was good. All the restaurants that we went to, we went to this restaurant called um, Five O uh, for dinner. Uh, there was another place that we went to for um, breakfast. It was just a lot of places to go to um, uh, to eat. And Maine is a good place to have lobster. Even though they seemed like they were a little, like, you know, low on the lobsters, you know. Um, but the restaurants were all fabulous. The people were wonderful. Very friendly. Uh, very nice place. Anyway, I suggest you go there. I don't know if you're going to get in because in the summertime, I hear it's very, very packed there. And, um, you know, <laughs> the room... The rooms and the suites that we had are probably going to be like three times as much. So what can I tell you? Um, the other thing I want to say, I went to Sears um, uh, last week. And, you know, I don't know. I know people talking about Sears closing and everything. Uh, I guess certain stores are just not making any money. But I happen to like Sears a lot. Um, they have a variety of things that you can get from there. And, um, you know, whether it's appliances or some clothes. I used to get my granddaughter clothes from there. My grandson, we spent a lot of time there. I got my washer and dryer, you know. Anyway, so one of the things that I that I noticed my cousin had when I went to Jacksonville was one of these, um, and everybody knows about these um, 
radios. They're the WeatherX radios. And I bought one, um, not just for the weather, but you know, I miss having a radio in the house. I know you can get pickup radio on the, um, you know, the computer and everything, but you know, I like this because even when, you know, the weather goes out or the electricity goes out, you can put the batteries in here and it, it really works. And I really like having this. So um, I'm going to hook this up because it's really, really good. And I love the fact that I get all these stations. Um, I like having radio in the morning. It reminds me of when I was in school, you know, getting up um, and all the radio stations. I went to sleep with radio. So I loved, I learned every song that I ever heard because I guess it was that stuff that you do when you're sleeping going to be trying to speak French and, and Mandarin with that too. I'm going to see how that works. I'll let you know. Konnichiwa. Okay. Um, merci beaucoup. Anyway, um, that's pretty much all that I have to say tonight because I haven't, you know, been around for a minute and, um, you know, lots of things are going on. Uh, so, um, I also want you guys to know that in the spring, I'm going to be doing a, it's called, um, um, a black rainbow pageant and um it's just about young women young black women um because we come in so many different shades and so many different colors to be proud of their um their uh, skin color and the fact that you know we are coming such a variety of colors mocha you know pecan tan you know all different things and so it's just a a good self-esteem building thing so if anybody wants help with that that'll be great and I'm also going to be doing the vagina monologues next year in March I believe it's going to be March 29th okay so and it'll be at the Riverfront Library in Yonkers don't know where the pageant's going to be just yet it may be at the Doubletree Hotel in Terrytown, but I'm not really sure anyway uh, thank you for tuning in and I hope you guys um, have a, a great evening and I'll get back with you again later on okay so have a great day and uh, don't too, do too much Christmas shopping, okay? I mean, spend time with family. That's what's really important. I'm just saying. All right. Um, you guys have a great one. Uh, like the show and, um, you know, subscribe. Tell some other people about it, okay? Thanks a lot for listening and thanks for tuning in. Talk to you soon. Bye now.